always tell the young people, listen, don't lose your good character because of someone else's bad character. A guy swore you in public. Are you going to swear back in the same public? If you did, what was the difference between the two of you? No difference. But a guy swore you. It has happened to me. There was a, there was a guy, he parked his car next to mine, not parked, but he, we stopped at the traffic light. He was very angry and upset because I overtook him. Anyway, he stopped there and he's making loud sounds with his big exhaust, which he fitted at the back of his Subaru. You know, big exhaust. He came, he started making big noise. He opened his window. He's showing me fingers, you know, fingers. He wants to swear. I looked at him, I said, just put my thumb like this. And he's swearing, swearing. I said, now because I'm praising his car, he's so happy. He doesn't know whether to smile or to cry. Because what did he want? He only wants to attract attention. I know that. He only wants people to say, wow, nice car. Nice car, right? So I like, he was so happy. He started laughing. He started doing and he was so in one second from swearing to being happy and excited. And I told myself, Wallahi, if I wanted, I could sway him back. Isn't it? Would it help? It wouldn't help. So think, think. Sometimes it's just excitement. 